Hey Rose, I'm Bo Papichi, and today's video we're back in the Canadian Mansion. But if you didn't know, last video I actually bought this mansion for like, I think like a thousand Robux. A uh, lot of money, obviously. And I turned, hang on, over here. There's like this little nursery right here. I kind of renovated it a little bit. And here it is. I really like it. If you want to see that video, it's my recent upload. But yeah, in today's video, actually someone commented this. I'm going to show the comment right here. But they said, hey Ophie, I have a build idea for you. What if, what if you did a Disney princess themed room? Like Rapunzel or something. First off, thank you for wishing me a good day and night. And actually, I've been debating actually doing a disney princess room i've been debating doing a tiana room but i'm gonna do rapunzel room today and like when deciding which room to do like i was like exploring the house like oh god which room do i do for a rapunzel room and then i saw this come on i cannot do a rapunzel not i cannot not do a rapunzel room up here come on it's like the perfect room it's all high up like a tower it's an office and i don't really like office what are you what what wait there's food in there what what Anyways, I'm getting distracted. I'm terribly sorry. So first things first, we need to delete absolutely everything in this bedroom or office or whatever it's called because it's not going to work for the vibe. Now, I'm not sure if I ever talked about this, but Rapunzel was my favorite Disney princess for a little bit. I literally dressed up as Rapunzel when I was probably like in second grade. Why is my walls painting? What the heck? Am I lagging? I'm about to like lag off the game. I oh, what? I guess these colors don't work weird. Okay, so I paint like a light purple of... Actually, you know, I like this purple. Let's paint this purple. I'm gonna paint this wall like a lighter purple and see how that looks. Like an accent wall. How's this look? Why is that different? Hold up. How did I goof that up? Okay, let's see. Which one do I like better? I kind of like this purple but at the same time. I like the lighter purple. I feel like it's easier on the eyes. Like, this purple look good on accents, though. So I'm painting the whole room a light lilac purple. That looks better. Now, as for the flooring, I'm going to change it up a little bit. What was the flooring in Rapunzel's house, actually? Okay, it looks like in Rapunzel, she has, like, uh, mosaics. Do we have any mosaics? Like, any tile that would work in here? Would this work in here? That looks like a kitchen. I had tiles like this in my kitchen when I was younger. How do these look? Okay, that's a bathroom tile. Okay, I think for simplicity's sake, we're just gonna go with like flooring, like wooden flooring. Because as much as I love mosaics and stuff like that, oh my god, they're so pretty. I'm actually gonna get rid of this modern railing and change it to classical. Because like, I feel like that matches Rapunzel's theme a bit more. Like when you think of Rapunzel, you think of like towers and you like medieval. I'm not sure that's the era she's in, do not like come after me. But you don't really think of like modern Rapunzel. At least I don't. Okay, so I have to like fuse with the wall because like there is no way I can like change it for some reason or make it shorter. We're gonna delete this one, put that right there. And how do I work this one? Hold up, I actually never swapped out railing. Oh what? I've been meaning to do this in like my regular house. I just haven't got around doing it yet. So like this is weird. It works. I'm not complaining. But I never worked the railing system before in this game. Okay, we're gonna let you know, scoot it over. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Okay, let's resize it a little bit to make it a bit easier on myself. And we're just gonna like scoot it over just like a smidge. That way it's like against the wall. Okay, then we're like gonna like lead it down the stairs. Here we go. How's that look? That? Oh goodness gracious! What happened here? Okay, we're gonna try to fix that. How's it look down here? That looks pretty good actually and then we're just gonna repeat it on this side i'm just gonna like cut this part out okay it looks really cute i'm actually really liking it holy crap now it looks a bit wonky from like downstairs like yeah it doesn't match the vibe at all but once you get upstairs it matches the vibe i am paint these like a goldish color like how does this look i'm going for like a deep chestnut kind of look how oh goodness gracious that's not chestnut that's full on like beige and not chestnut let's see how that looks I like that actually. I feel like the flooring needs to be a bit darker, so I'm gonna change that real quick. So I feel like it goes along better with the stairs. Yeah, I actually like that a lot better. Now over here, I actually have an idea. I need an image. You need that right there. And again, if you need the codes for these like images I use in my videos, it should be in the pinned comment down below. So let's insert that. Look at that. I think that's the one above her fireplace in the movie. I think so. Like resize it a little bit. That's huge, holy crap. And then I want some curtains around it like in the movie. So, so let's look for curtains. Once again, I'm using the stage curtains because like this time I just like how they flow. But again, you can use these ones. Actually, this one actually might look better. Hold the phone. I actually really like that. We're gonna like scoot it over a bit more. That was like kind of touching the wall. How's that? Oh, wow. That's staying. Okay. We're gonna paint like the frame, like the same color as the railing. If it lets me. And then we're paint the curtains red. Like, no, like a dark, like a wine red. How's that look? Now, why are you going behind the painting? What? What in the world? It looks good. I like it. But like, it keeps on going like behind the painting as soon as I walk too far away. What? Okay, we're gonna see how the stage curtain looks over here. Because like, it's bugging me. Like, it works, but like, it's just bugging me. I'm just gonna like put it over it because I, I don't want to delete it just in case I don't like it. We're gonna delete the original one. I deleted the wrong one. 
There we go. That looks cute. You cannot tell me otherwise. We'll keep the carrots the same color, but we're gonna repaint the top of it, the like the chestnut look. Dang it, that's the wrong one. And look at that. I like it. Now we need a bed. I have like the perfect bed in mind. And like this is my favorite anything in cinematic history in my opinion. It's like that one scene where- where is the bed? But anyways, the scene where like they're on the water with all the lanterns. Oh my gosh. That was cute. You couldn't tell me otherwise. This boat. Now I know it's a pirate ship, but it's the only boat themed uh, bed we have that I'm aware of. So we're using it. Try to figure out where to put it at, because like, I don't want to put it right here and the kid not see- Wait, hold up. We can use this as a little play area, but where would the bed go? I'm struggling. You know what, we're actually going to put the bed against the wall right here. And I can't really find like an exact picture of the boat used in the movie. What color is it? Oh, I cannot- I can't repaint the wood. No, I'm painting the wood like green, like this part green. Actually, let's paint it yellow. Because she, like, she's literally- like I forgot what she- the word for it. Oh, I'm about to be called out in the comments. But we're gonna paint this like yellow? I actually really like that. It has been a while since I watched Rapunzel. I'm not even making this up. It has been a good couple years. But anyways, ignoring that, we're actually gonna get some lanterns, because I have an idea. Can I resize these? Oh, that's perfecter. But we're gonna need some walls. The reason why we need walls is because, like, so I can set the lanterns on something. So, like, we're gonna do this and make them look like they're floating. That one right there. We're just gonna put, like, a few down to kind of, like, test how they look. Because for all I know, this can look like absolute dookie. But you never know until you try. Let's see. I actually kind of like that. Hey, let me turn off my interactions so I don't like see just straight up interactions. Oh, and it gives me an idea for the roof actually. Oh, what? Okay, I was kind of hoping I could repaint the roof like the same color. Hold up, I have an idea. There is this wallpaper that I didn't find out about until like after I record like an Everest video. Yeah, it's literally the night sky. If I can angle it just right, I should be able to like just use it as the roof. I cannot use it as- dang it, that would look so nice. No big deal, I'm just gonna repaint this roof black. Just straight up black. That's gray, not black. There we go. Actually, I feel like straight up black would look weird. I want like a dark purple, like bruised purple. I actually kind of like that. You know, okay, I was add like a night sky kind of feel to the roof, but I have a better idea actually. We're gonna need a wall. We're gonna need to shrink it down a little bit, like so. I'm actually gonna put it against the roof. And it's gonna add like support beams. Like that's not the right word. We're gonna recolor these like a kind of like a woodish look. It would seem we don't have any. Okay, shoot. How would this look? No, that wouldn't work. Now, how would a log look actually? That's the real question. This could work actually. Put it right there. It's kind of like stretch it across. Oh, that would cover up the painting though. Okay, no big deal. Let's just like put it like a bit right there. Stretch it out. And like copy and paste it across the roof. I'm not sure what kind of vibe this is going for. I'm not even sure this fits the era of the movie, honestly. I just think it looks cool. Let's like delete the ones in between. Because I like how it looks, actually. But does it match? Wait a minute. I know it'll match the vibe. But let's delete these. How would this look in here, actually? Let's, like put it in the corners. And what's that look like? Hold up. I like that, actually. That looks really cool. So we're going to copy and paste that into... Should I put it in this corner? We're going to. Put that in the corner. I kind of put that too much in the corner. How's that look? I kind of like that. Put it in this corner, too. Move over this bed and put it in this corner. And we're going to paint the same color as the wood. Because looking at pictures of Rapunzel's house, most of her stuff is wood. So we kind of weird have like marble statues or pillars in your house. We don't have pillars. I feel like the windows need to match the pillars, too. And then for the blinds, I'm actually going to make them green. Because like, you no know, Pascal and green is a nice color. Let's see how that Oh, wow. I'm actually really liking this. Holy crap. Oh, I forgot like one window. It's like hidden in the corner. I think I colored that right. I colored that wrong. Dang. You know what? We're actually just gonna delete that window and it's like hide where the window was because I'm not gonna deal with that window because it doesn't even window. We're definitely getting somewhere. I really like it. So we move this back over to the corner. Actually, I'm not sure. Should we like put it like? Wait a minute. We just put like this. Actually. I don't know, I don't want to cover up the painting because I really like the painting. But at the same time, it does look nice right there. Like, let's look at it through the window. I like it, let's keep it. I have some fun facts about Tangled. Oh, I'm at this over here. But yeah, on Tangled, uh, they literally got, I, I kid you not, I looked this up, I made sure. They gathered a group of women, put them in a room, and just asked them to describe an attractive guy. And that's how we got Flynn Rider. <laughs> but yeah, I think that's like the goofiest way to get a character. Like, imagine your boss coming up to you like, hey, uh, Shelby, so we need you in the boardroom 
room to describe a really attractive man. Just imagine like waking up on a Tuesday afternoon, going to work and that happening. I would be so deeply confused. I wouldn't even go. I would just assume they're joking around. I kind of like that. Actually, no, I'm gonna delete it. I think it's cute, but then again, it's like a toddler. Not a toddler, like a more of like, um, it's like a seven-year-old room, I think. I think. I don't know. I think. I don't know. Now we need to add some castle stuff in here. There's this one item I really like, but I can't find it. I used it in Rosie's room. Ooh, a castle. Can I shrink it down? I can. Okay, we're gonna keep that for now. I'm also gonna put this one in here. I'm just gonna put that like in the center of this wall. It's like right there. I think that looks cute. Can I paint like the red? That's the real question. Oh, we're stuck with the red. I might delete that in a bit because I'm not entirely set on that. But this thing I am. We're just gonna like slap it over here in this corner. And what can I repaint? Okay, so we're keeping the pink. I'm gonna go with like go with like purple. Uh, not that doesn't look good. How about this purple? And like another shade of purple. That's cute. You cannot tell me otherwise. Next, we're going with the iconic thing I always add in my builds. A flower lawn thing my job. It actually goes with this build technically. Because now flowers and Rapunzel, like those things coincide. So we're making this look like a little lawn. So I make this like green and green. How's that look? I think that goes good in here. It matches the curtains, so we're gonna need some flowers. Put it right there. Right there. Made some bigger on the edge. Well, that's too big, actually. But right there should work. Shrink it down more. And right there. Now we need some grass. I'm gonna paint the grass like the same color as the rug. If I can figure out which color I painted the rug. What color did I paint the rug again? Okay, I think that's the same color as the rug. I'm really not sure. But we're gonna like move it around, like put it in like random spots. That is not the same color as the rug. Hold on, I'm just gonna like, repaint the rug entirely. How's that look? That matches a lot better. Now I feel like the kiss now I feel like since the character in here is actually literally an artist, we need an art station. It would be a travesty if I didn't include an art station. This one actually works perfectly. I was like looking for a random table, but like this- Oh my gosh, I actually really like this. We're gonna delete this castle for now. And I think like we're gonna put this carpentry table over here. It's like rotate it a little bit. And how's that look? I can't even sit down on it. No, I can't sit down on it. What? And I feel like this like old chest would actually fit in perfectly over here. I hate the noises it makes though. Like the literal noises thing makes is like nightmare fuel. But I need it for the build. I would put this one in here, but like at the same time. Now the bank put this one in here, but like I'm not really sure. Like let me delete this one real quick. Like both of them would look really good in here, honestly. But I only want one in here. So I think we'll leave this one in here. And I'm gonna put some more I'm gonna put some kids stuff in here. Put this over here. And we're gonna paint like the same color as this dresser. We're paint like the same color as this thing. At least attempt to. How's that look? That doesn't really match, but hey, who cares? I think it looks good. Now I'm gonna need some frames, actually. Just kinda like put these right here. Because I have oh shoot, that's a really low lit roof. Okay, so we're like make size these down a little bit. Make them a little bit smaller. Just kinda like scatter them on the roof or wall. On the wall. We're not gonna keep them totally straight because like it's Rapunzel. Like Miss Ma'am. She's an icon, okay? Literally a chaotic mess and I love her. Put that right there. Put that one right there. And while the last one loads, I'm actually gonna rotate these a little bit because I rotated them wrong earlier. Put them back where they were. I'm gonna recolor them gold. How's that look? I like that. The last PNG I need for this wall is taking absolutely forever to load. So I'm just gonna let that, this vibe, I guess. Ooh, that is not against the wall. Hello. And also, this gave me an idea. I love this item. Holy crap. It's the restaurant hanging frame. It's so pretty. Look at it. I think I'm gonna put it in here, actually. Like, I wasn't sure about it, but now I think I am. But I'm not sure if I add it, it'll be, like, adding too much to the room. Because I'm a maximalist, but, like, at the same time, I know when enough's enough, for the most part. How's that look? Okay, that's a bit too much, I think. I think we should just add, like, one row down the middle. Or two rows, actually. Let's add two rows down the middle and see how that looks. I kind of like it. No, okay, let's go downstairs and go back upstairs and see how it looks from there. Hold up. We just need to like, get our eyes off it for a few seconds and then, like, head back upstairs and see how I like it. I'm not the biggest fan. We're gonna delete it. Now, I actually have an idea for right here. We need a tree. Which tree should I use? You know, I think we'll use the eucalyptus tree, shrink it down a little bit, and then we'll get two of them. And one I'll make slightly bigger than the other, like about like that should be good. Rotate it a bit, put it right there. And I'm gonna need some shelves. Watch, I'm gonna need a wall and then some shelves. I think like this shelf should work over here. It's kind of like resizing the fit about right there. How's that look? We're gonna delete this wall real quick and see how it looks. 
That looks cute and you can't tell me otherwise. Now I actually like the color of the trees right now. So I'm actually going to keep that. If I can figure out like what color exactly they are. I might have to repaint them because I can't figure out what color they are. You know what? That looks good. I like that. I was kind of scared that wasn't going to look good. But that looks perfect. And on here, I'm going to put like random stuff she probably collected. So for creativity, we're going to put a little diamond. We're going to put a glowing flower to kind of like, you know, it's Rapunzel. We're going to hint at her having glowing flowers and stuff in her story. A little toy bear. We're going to put him about like right there. It's kind of make it look like he's like thrown on the shelf and forgotten about. We're going to put a little toy car right there. And actually, I'm going to get a little art lesson thing with job. Set that right there for a second. That diamond right there. And hopefully, fingers crossed, I can put it up here. It looks like it fits. So I'm about to move the flower somewhere else. Put that right about right there. I think I'm going to delete the car and put the flower right there. And as for the picture, I'm going to use like a random picture I have already. You know what? I'm just going to put this picture right here because it looks cute. It's like, I forgot his name, but it's from Winnie the Pooh. Now the last image actually loaded it in, so I'm going to put it right about here. If it lets me. I don't think it's going to let me. Shoot. I'll just copy this one and just put it on this one. I'm just going to delete this one and put it right here. There we go. And we don't exactly have a lizard height chart, but we do have a caterpillar one. And they look pretty similar. So we're just going to put them right about right, right there. And I think we need more lanterns. So I'm going to get a wall and put it right about right, right there. And again, we're just going to copy and paste the lanterns. I'm just going to add like about three more. Kind of like scatter them around the room. How's that look? That's cute. I like that. Now I'm debating adding curtains, but I'm really not sure actually. You know what? Okay, for now I'm not going to add curtains, but I might in the future. But for now, no curtains. But Royals, are you ready for the reveal? Let's go see it. So up here we have a lovely little room. Oh my goodness. You have a view outside. You have this lovely lawn. It reminds you of Rapunzel because like the flowers. And plus like she was like trotting through the fields when she first got out of the tower. We have a little tree bookshelf with painting supplies, a teddy bear, a flower, creativity stone, a really cool looking chest, a little creativity workshop little thingamajob. Over here has some toys, some concept art of Rapunzel. It's like literal concept art of Rapunzel. Like I think you look close enough you can see her. You have the painting that hung over her fireplace in the movie. Just look at it. It's even got red curtains like the movie. A little boat that's kind of reminiscent of like that one suit with her and Flynn Rider. A castle and floating lanterns. But what else? What do you think about this build? Comment down below. It was really fun to do. I had a lot of fun doing it. I never really do a bunch of Disney princess stuff, so I, this was fun. I'm hoping next video maybe I can do like Tiana because oh my gosh I am a Tiana girly. But or else if you enjoyed this video please like comment subscribe it's really up to you. And comment down below who is your favorite Disney princess. Without further ado or else you have an amazing day. Stay hydrated and stay safe. Bye!